In this lesson, we will see how to select the object properly in 3D Max. I just go and say open. If you locate in your uh, project folder, you will have the selection window and say open. So in this, I'll just change it to shapes. So I'll press G on my keyboard to remove this grid. So these are the duplicated objects. It's not these very simple objects. We have made duplicates. So the first thing if you see, I'll just dragging and this marching ants, if just getting on there, it will get selected something like this. See, if you touch it, you get the selection. If you touch this, you get the selection. Just you have to get set touch of this marching end of the selection. You will get the selection. You can move or rotate whatever you want. So how it behaves you can change it from here if you see a rectangle circular something like this from build only four i want if i like this or see click 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 i can make selection from where to where i want the selection or else it's like this selecting how much you want selecting how much you want in process in this process if you want just uh, just whatever i have selected i want that selection to be inside it so we'll we call it window crossing so i'll say click and if i drag something like this and it will get selected six of this see but if you touch this option touch another object it will not get selected see it should be proper inside that selection this is what the window crossing does so again if i get outside this white object like this on the line it means when I, wherever i am selecting getting the line touched it will get selected it will like this so interesting part we have spray as well like if you click like this you can get selected see this is what you can just spray it where you want you get the selection it's very easy to select like this from the spray but personally i do this type of selection selecting and i feel very comfortable to use this so it's up to you whichever you want you can use that and in another thing if you select i'll say the name should be one then this should be two this maybe we have given a name from your three so if you want selection from the name that's a name selection if you click select by name and the shortcut is h on your keyboard if you press h on your keyboard i'll show you again h this this will appear and it's nothing inside if you see this is display geometry you can get all those things in geometry if you have lights in the scene you will get all lights in the scene if you have shapes all light shapes will be displayed something like that so you can select like this and say okay the by the name you can select and you can move you rotate or scale whatever you want so this is what so this is what uh, the selection we can do from here it's a name selection select by name and the types of selection uh, we have seen and cross windows so in next lesson we will see more things so thank you for seeing this part